it is a very good evening to you guys welcome to our thursday night smartphone quiz i'm your host john o'connor it is great to be back here once again this thursday night and it's great to see such good numbers 19 teams so far there's the 20th just gone in uh we're going to do battle as usual guys over 75 questions coming your way over the next hour and 15 minutes three rounds of 25 we'll take a short break as per usual after question 25 and again after question 50. cash prize as usual every thursday that is 25 percent of the entrance fees received goes back out to the winners of course those winners have to be verified that they did purchase the pin we had a scenario once where uh, that didn't happen we had to give the prize to second place the highest paid player will win the cash prize no other way uh, what have we got for you so it's general knowledge as usual we have two quizzes this weekend uh, starting of course tonight and again we're back here on saturday night so if you're at a loose end next saturday night nine o'clock we're going to be doing another general knowledge quiz so jump on and get some of those tickets they are available on livequizzing.com of course, if there's anyone watching there on YouTube wondering how do we jump in here, uh, the link is livequizzing.com. At the very bottom of that page, you'll see a link for tonight's quiz. Purchase the pin and you are in with a chance of winning that cash prize, provided you are the team on the top of the scoreboard from tonight's quiz. We are available on YouTube live chat as well. Uh, Damien saying is the sound really low for everyone. How is it now when the microphone is switched on? Damien, is it okay? Rachel says the sound is okay. It's fine on her end. Maybe just the lobby music was just a bit low. Okay, and well, I come on then. I upset everything. So still more teams popping on online there. So, um... Just make sure that you have your Kahoot uh, pin purchased as well, okay? Any teams in the top five that we recognize as a team that hasn't purchased the pin, they can see themselves being ejected from the game. We don't want to do that, so make sure you get those uh, those pins purchased. And we'll give you till uh, round two or three to get those purchased if you're here without the uh, pin purchased. Otherwise, teams will start getting ejected that haven't got a pin. That's in the top five. Damien's happy. That's good enough for me. <laughs> That's a very good evening to you all, guys. Are we ready to do battle here so on tonight's quiz? Kahoot is back. I think so. Let's begin. Why not? Okay, let's see. Very best to look to everyone taking part in tonight's quiz. Multiple choice, mostly. In the Harry Potter books, which article tells the pupils the house they would belong to at Hogwarts? Is it the sorting scot, the sorting glove, the sorting hat, or the sorting sock? Always little small changes Kahoot are making on this game. We can see that the uh, text is a little bit bigger on the multiple choice this week. All better to see you with. Locking in those answers as quick as you can will earn you more points. When all teams lock in the answer, the countdown stops. 23 correct answers here with the sorting hat. Okay, so after each question, we take a look at the scoreboard. The top five teams are on the uh, screen. Your score should be on the bottom right-hand corner. You'll find it somewhere. It's on the app. Right, question number two now next. Unsweetened chocolate is known as all, but which one of these? Is it bitter, cooking, baking, or sour? Fourteen correct answers. Sour is the answer we're looking for. Okay, so outnumbered is the team 
in the lead, S5 in second place, as we play question 3 next. From which direction did the last surviving Wicked Witch of Wizard of Oz come from? Was it the north, the east, the west, or the south? Witch of the West. 17 of you answered this correctly. So, new leaders right now. Megalodon went on. We're in second place. Here's question four. When leaving Dublin, what direction is the M4? Is it the north, east, west, or south? Ten correct answers with the West. Well played. Now we have Francis. Brennan is the team in the lead. Well played. Here's question number five. Which country produces the most apples? Is it USA, China, France or South Africa? So which country produces the most apples? Ten correct answers with China is correct. So outnumbered. Having a look at pole position. Question number six next. Kofi Annan, a former UN Secretary General, was born in where? Died at the age of 80, was it Kenya? Nigeria, Ghana, or South Africa? Thirteen correct answers with Ghana is correct. Outnumbered still in the lead. Here is question seven. Super Tuesday is a key date in the calendar of which country's elections? Is it Australia, USA, New Zealand, or South Africa? So Super Tuesday. It's a key date in the calendar of which country's election? Twenty-one correct answers. USA is correct. Only a couple of weeks from doing that again. Here's Norfolk and Chance in the second place. My favorite team in third. Sir Isaac Hunt in fourth. Here is question eight. The warthog. It's native to which continent? Is it Asia, Africa, Europe, or South America? Pretty correct answers with Africa. Well done. Let's see what that's done for the scoreboard. My favorite team in the second place. Unleashed in third. Question nine looks like this. Marco Polo is most associated with the exploration of which continent? Is it Australia, Asia, Africa, South America?
Asia is correct. 18 of you answered that spot on. Next five into third place. Here's question 10. The Kookaburra, it's an emblem of which Australian state? Is it New South Wales, Queensland, Victoria or South Australia? New South Wales. Most teams are uh, well done. Excellent stuff. Question 11. So next. Martini with a dash of dry Vermont and garnished with olive or lemon zest makes what? Is it a Manhattan, Cosmopolitan, extra dry martini or South Beach martini? Nineteen correct answers with extra dry martini. Question number twelve next. Which country's team has clinched the twenty eighteen Uber Cup and the women's world badminton badminton championship? Is it Japan, Thailand, China or South Korea? Japan is correct. 13 teams answer this. Let's see the scores. S5 moves into second place now, and Sir Isaac Hunt into fourth. Question 13. The actress and presenter Claire Sweeney comes from which city? Is it Glasgow, Liverpool, Birmingham, or Southampton? Liverpool is correct, 20 teams. Here comes question 14. Which of these is a non-metallic metric system of weights and measures? Is it majestic, imperial, noble, sovereign? Is correct 15 correct answers question 15 so next the computer game Tetris was invented in the 1980s but in what country was it Japan USA China Soviet Union Yeah, Soviet Union, 12 correct answers for that. Highest received answer. Unleashed is now into third place. Hardy's is the highest climber. Up three places. Question 16. Which of these countries has the highest population? Is it United Kingdom, Egypt, Philippines or South Africa?
Okay, 11 correct answers with the uh, Philippines. That's the most popular answer here. Let's see what that does for the score. Only second place in the top five answered it correctly by favorite team. Well played. Okay, so question 17. We're looking for the first letter of your answer. No need to type out the full thing. What's the name of this movie? First letter of your answer is plenty. Make sure you hit the uh, submit button just to uh, make sure those answers get to us. Okay, so 23 of you locked in your answer in time. Let's have a look at some of those answers. Across the board, quite a few different ones. Young Guns, nine correct answers. Podgy Bunty into fourth place. Here is question 18. What country launched the uh, space station Skylab back in 1973? Was it Great Britain, France, United States, or Soviet Union? So which country launched the uh, space station Skylab in 1973? Great Britain, France, United States, or Soviet Union? It is the United States' most popular answer. So I second into fifth place. Question 19, so next. Which of these arcade games was released first? Is it Donkey Kong, Pac-Man, Golden Axe, or Space Invaders? So which of these arcade games was released first? Twenty-three correct answers with Space Invaders. Excellent. No change here. Question twenty next. Where was St. Patrick born? Ireland, Britain, Africa or Spain? Yeah. Unanimously, the 23 teams, Britain is correct. Well done. Question 21. Sherry originated in which country? Is it Chile, Greece, Algeria, or is it Spain? Fourteen correct answers. Here it is, Spain. Let's have a look at the scores. Outnumbered team still in the lead. Favorite uh, team is in second. Olish third. Question twenty-two. Then, hey Con, it's a traditional name for kings, but for which country is it? Belgium, Norway, Greece, or Spain? Twenty-four correct answers with Norway. Perfect answer. Well played. Question twenty-three: Where did Daniel fly to on a plane in the Elton John song? Is it New York, Morocco, India, or Spain?
Spain being the correct answer here. Nine teams. So Isaac moved into uh, fourth place with this one. Question 24. The Rottweiler breed of dog is named after a town, but in which country? Netherlands, Germany, France, Spain. Twenty-five correct answers. It is, of course, Germany. Podge moved into uh, fourth place here. Let's get one more question before we take a short break. What type of barn traditionally has a curved roof and no walls? German bar, Dutch bar, French bar, Spanish bar. German barn, Dutch barn, French barn, Spanish barn. Twenty-one correct answers with the uh, Dutch barn is the correct answer. Let's take a short look at the uh, the break. Sorry, short look at uh, the scoreboard while we take a break here, folks. When we come back, we have the questions, of course, to round number two. The next twenty-five questions. We'll see you shortly back here for that.
Okay, so guys, welcome back to uh, tonight's quiz. Round two, if you want to call it that. The next 25 questions ready to go. And let's see how you can get on with these. Outnumbered is the team to catch at the moment. Let's continue with the quiz. Here it is, question 26. The International Brigade was a volunteer force formed to fight in which war? Is it the Korean War, Vietnam War, American Civil War, or the Spanish Civil War? Okay, so let's have a look at the answers. 15 uh, correct answers with the Spanish Civil War. Let's have a look at the scores. Next question, here's question 27. On which continent is the Serengeti National Park? Is it Europe, North America, Africa or South America? Twenty-seven. That's all teams answering correctly with Africa. That is the correct answer. Excellent stuff. We'll have a look at the scores in just a second. Before we do that, I have a little request I want to do here. First of all, I want to say a big, big happy birthday to Mary Kate, who's uh, celebrating her twelfth birthday today. Happy birthday to you, Mary Kate. Uh, she's been doing the quiz every week since lockdown as well, and that comes in from her godfather, John. Leah and Sean as well. So a happy birthday to you. All right. Here's the scores. Next question then. The song of which bird is traditionally a sign that spring has arrived? Is it the jackdaw, the cuckoo, the owl or the sparrow? So the song of which bird is traditionally a sign that spring has arrived. Twelve correct answers with the cuckoo is correct. Next question, question 29, here we go. In the abbreviations GCSE, what does the letter S actually stand for? Is it schools, secondary, standard, or special? Secondary is correct. Well done to the 13 teams. Question 30 coming up next. What is the Royal Navy equivalent of the Army's SAS? Is it the Special Submarine Service, Special Boat Service, Special Fleet Service or Special Underwater Service? Yeah, 13 correct answers for the special boat service. No change, outnumbered, still holding on to pole position. Here's question 31 next. Which of these is a butterfly and not 
a moth? Is it Mother Shipton? Is it a red underwing? Is it a burnished brass? Or is it a speckled wood? Ten correct answers with speckled wood is correct. Well played. Top three not answering correctly. Let's see how question 32 looks. Which of these Hollywood stars has won the most Best Actor Oscars? Is it Marlon Brando, Laurence Olivier, Daniel Day-Lewis or Spencer Tracy? Yeah, 16 correct answers. Daniel Day-Lewis by a long shot as well. Okay, so Unleashed have just moved into second place, overtaken my favorite team, S5 in fifth. Question 33 next. If a, if a dish is served a la Fontaine, it would include which of these vegetables? Is it carrot, onion, potato or spinach? Yeah, spinach is correct. 17 correct answers for this. So Isaac into fifth place now with question 34 next. Which fish catches insects by spitting at them and knocking them down into the water? Is it a target fish, archer fish, dart fish or spitter fish? Archerfish is correct. 16 correct answers. Gap is not as big at the top as it once was. As we play question 35 now. Uh, Patagonia. It's a region, but in what continent? Is it the Antarctica, Australia, Africa or South America? Twenty-one correct answers. South America, spot on. Well played. No change here. Bucks quiz is back with an answer streak of three. Here's question thirty-six. Now, which of these is a problem hairdresser might deal with? Is it split screen, split seconds, split personalities, or split ends? Yeah, 25 correct answers. One team said split seconds. Another team said split personality. Let's have a look at the scores. Question 37 next. Ken Baker played which character in the Star Wars franchise? Is it C-3PO or 2-D2, Chewbacca or is it Spock? Fourteen correct answers with or two D two. Question thirty eight looks like this. This is Callum McLaughlin. Uh, what is his character's name? The TV series Stranger Things. Is it Steve 
Dustin, Lucas, or Mike? Yeah, Lucas, correct answer 22. If you answer this correctly, S5 in fifth. Question 39. Uh, Steven Hillenberg, who died in 2018, was creator of which popular Nickelodeon cartoon character? Was it Dora the Explorer, Cat Dog, Doug, or is it SpongeBob SquarePants? It is SpongeBob SquarePants, 24 correct answers. Hope the birthday girl, Mary, did you get this one right? I hope you did. Question 40 next. What's with what sort of books are the names Mills and Boone? They're associated with crime, romance, cookery or sports. Yeah, it is romance. Correct answer. Four incorrect answers for this one. Unleashed moving into second place and Norfolk and chance into fifth. All right, question 41. Which season is referred to in a John Keats poem as seasons of mist and mellow fruitfulness? Is it winter, autumn, summer or spring? Autumn is correct, and uh, 21 teams answered this correctly. Seven incorrect answers received. Question 42 next. Which word is often used by actors to simulate background conversation? Is it cauliflower, rhubarb, gooseberry, sprouts? Ten correct answers. Rhubarb. Excellent. Okay, question 43. What was the surname of Frodo's companion, Sam, in The Lord of the Rings? Was it Brandybuck? Took Gamgi or Spuds? Twenty-two correct answers, six incorrect. Question 44. So which of these animals is renowned for having very poor eyesight? Hare, fox, mole, squirrel. Yeah, 25 correct answers with mole is correct. Question 45. Google is trading on the NASCAR. Under what symbol? 
options below. Twelve correct answers. Yellow option well played. Let's have a look at the scores. My favorite team back in second place. Question 46 next. The Temple of the Tooth, one of the most sacred Buddhist shrines, is in what country? Cambodia, India, Japan, Sri Lanka. Temple of the Tooth. Fifteen correct answers. Sri Lanka is perfect. Well played. Norfolk into fifth place. Paji is on an answer streak, however, of 23 correct answers in a row. Question 47. So, in formal correspondence, which of these signifies that a letter has been signed on someone else's behalf? PP, QQ, or RSS? Yeah, 21 correct answers with PP and 6 incorrect answers. Scores at the doors. Like this. Outnumbered. Still in the lead. Question 48 next. The season of Advent begins on the Sunday closest to which saint day? St. Andrew, St. David, St. George or St. Patrick? St. Andrews, the correct option, 13 teams. Let's see what that's done for the scoreboard. Top five answering correctly. Gertrude is making a comeback, three in a row. Here's question 49. Funeral services for the boxing legend Muhammad Ali, who died at the age of 74, was held in his hometown of, is it Kansas? Uh, sorry, Arkansas, is it Kansas, Kentucky or Missouri? Fourteen correct answers with Kentucky. Let's have a look. Question 50, folks. You can put the first letter of your answer in here. What car company makes this car? First letter of your answer is fine. Make sure you press submit as quick as you can. Okay, let's have a look. How many had it? Just the three for Aston Martin. Okay, let's take a look at the scores while we take this uh, second and final break. We'll see you back here in five minutes.
Okay, so guys, welcome back to the third and final part of tonight's quiz. Hope you're not too far behind. The leaders outnumbered who've been sitting in pole position for quite some time. There is still 25 questions, however, uh, if you're going to catch them, you've got to do it in the next 25. 
Right, so without further ado, let's continue on with tonight's quiz. Question 51. What is a white dwarf? Is it mushroom, gerbil, cocktail, or star? Okay, so 16 of you put in star as the answer. That is correct. Question 52. Which of these is the name of a plant? Is it gem of Jerusalem, star of Bethlehem, jewel of Jordan, or star of David? Star of Bethlehem is correct. Well done, 13 teams. That's changed a few positions. Unleashed into second. Haji Waji into third. And S5 in fifth. Okay, so question 53. In the traditional Batman original story, what movie did Wayne, the Wayne family see the night Bruce, Bruce's parents were murdered? Gone with the Wind, Titanic, Mask of Zorro, or Star Wars? Mask of Zorro, seven correct answers. Well played. Question 54, who or which company announced it is to buy the UK coffee chain Costa Coffee for $5.1 billion, Coca-Cola, PepsiCo, Dunkin' Donuts or Starbucks? Coca-Cola is correct. 11 correct answers out there. Question 55. Which of these creatures is a type of fish? Eel, jellyfish, sperm whale, starfish. Yeah, 18 great answers with eel, 9 incorrect answers. Okay, favourite team in second place. Question 56 now. What did Liam Gallagher and Patsy Kenseth call their son who was born in September 1999? Is it Lennon, McCartney, Harrison or Starr? It is Lennon. That's the correct answer. A big fan of John Lennon he was. Um, 15 correct answers. Let's have a look at the scores. Question 57 next. Which word is a noun meaning to prepare land? Is it safe, vault, till, 
stash. Twenty six correct answers well played. Okay, next one. Here's question 58. Which of these Olympic events is the longest? Is it the 20 kilometer walk, the marathon, the 10,000 meters or steeplechase? Yeah, this is the marathon. 18 correct answers. Okay, leaders not answering this one correctly. The four below them, however, did. Okay, question 59. What does Gaga's mother call her when she's being bad? Is it Lady Bad Bad, Monster, Spider Woman, Stephanie? Stephanie is correct, that's her proper name. 12 correct answers. 12 went with Monster. And 4 for Lady Bad Bad. Next question, question 60. According to the Oxford English Dictionary, which of these is a shade of grey? Newcastle Coal, London Smoke, Manchester Sky. Sixteen correct answers with London Smoke. That is correct. Third place not answering correctly here. Question 61. What is the only non-European country to have taken part in every Summer Olympic Games? Australia, South Africa, USA. Correct answer, Australia. All right, let's head for question 62 now. What name is given to the molten rock yet to erupt from a volcano? Magma, pyroclast, or brimstone? Magma is correct, 24 correct answers. Unleashed into third place. Here is question 63 next. Before continental drift pushed them apart, which continent was tucked into Africa's Gulf of Guinea? Is it Europe, Asia or South America?
16 correct answers. South America is perfect. Well played. First and second answering correctly. Spanish Armada. Is it the Glorious Revolution, the French Revolution, or the Russian Revolution? Glorious Revolution is the one we're looking for here. First place answering it correctly, Unleashed, also in the top five. Question 66. Airing for six seasons until 2007, which HBO series revolved around a character named Tony who led a crime organization? The Sopranos, Bad Blood, Mob City, Boardwalk Empire. The Sopranos is the correct answer. Twenty four correct answers. Question 67 next. What part of the body would you find a lunula? Is it a hand, leg, head or foot? Lunula, is it the hand, leg, head or foot? Thirteen correct answers. Hand is correct. As seen in the picture, but you could never trust those pictures. Second place not answering this one correctly. Bucks quiz. Tells me it's about making a comeback three in a row. Question 68. Uh, popular uh, purple character Barney is what type of dinosaur? Is it a Stegosaurus? Uh, Diplodocus, is it a Tyrannosaurus Rex or Brontosaurus? Tyrannosaurus Rex, correct answer, 15 teams. Top 5 answering correctly. Question 69 now. Singer Elvis Presley owned three Cadillac cars that were what color? Silver, blue, pink, or gold? All right, let's have a look at your answers. Pink is the correct answer. 16 teams. Leaders not answering correctly. Is there enough time and enough questions? Can they be caught? Here's question 70. Something that is described as a catawampus is most likely in what state? Neat and tidy. Underwater. Disarray. Flying in the air. Twenty one correct answers. Disarray is correct. Excellent stuff. Question seventy one now. 
The Mississippi River runs through 10 states and flows into the Gulf of Mexico. But in what state does it begin? Is it Mississippi, Missouri, Minnesota, Iowa? Okay, so let's have a look at uh, 11 correct answers with Minnesota. Question 72 coming your way. Vermilion, it's a shade of what color? Is it green, blue, yellow or red? Red is correct answer, 17 teams. Excellent stuff. Okay, let's have a look at question 73 now. What is the capital of Texas? Dallas, Houston, San Antonio, Austin. Sixteen um, correct answers with Austin is correct. First and second place answering this one correctly. Question 74. So when did the ball eagle become the official emblem of the United States 1782 1956 1812 or 1776 Okay, so nine correct answers. 1782 is the correct answer. Gap is increasing now. They're not to be caught, I don't think, as we play the final question. First, it's actually a digit answer, I believe. Using your digits, how many years did it take to complete Mount Rushmore? Using digits, make sure you press enter. Okay, let's have a look at some of the answers. Someone said 210, someone said a lot. Correct answer is in fact 14 years. 10 correct answers. Okay, so guys, that is it. 75 questions done and dusted for this Thursday night. We're gonna give you the results in just a few minutes time, which will of course be uh, confirmed on our Facebook page at uh, livequizzing.com or John O'Connor smartphone quiz. I'll put up the full scores there shortly. Uh, before we do the results, uh, we have some raffle tickets here. We have them all organized tonight. Um, if you have added raffle tickets to your order, the four-digit order number is what's reading on the back of this small cash prize, which we'll send on, and the number. The back of this is 2812. 28 
12. That's the order number for tonight. You have won the raffle. Well done. Let's have a look so then at the unofficial results from tonight's quiz. Let's have a look. Third place, Unleashed. Second place, my favorite team. And for the team that spent most of the night in pole position, outnumbered are this week's cash winners of the quiz. So we'll be in touch with those and we'll forward on the cash prize to them very, very soon. Uh, that's about it for me tonight. As I mentioned earlier, we have another quiz, unusually enough, this Saturday night. Uh, we've been tempting to throw on a second quiz. So if you want to join us again Saturday, another general knowledge quiz. We'll have the tickets available for that a little later on. And uh, if we don't see you before, so have yourselves a great weekend, okay? I'll see you again soon. Do take care. Good night to you, folks.